soldiers, but I had no idea they were involved in such a top secret operation. These files are pretty unclear. I need to find more operation records. If I follow the trail, I might be able to find a lead or two. when I was a kid. But Mom loved them. It was seriously weird. I mean, she named me Bunny for crying out loud. Enough of that. These records seem to indicate my parents were looking for something. Hmm. Soldiers who aren't descendants don't usually carry out operations in such dangerous zones. I wonder if Alpha or Nell know more about this. Got a question about the operation? What is it, Bunny? Do you have something to report? Not exactly. I've been looking into some of the records and I noticed something unusual. Could I get access to other records related to this operation? Unfortunately, the records of operations from that time are incomplete. Even if you can locate them, most of them are unreadable. But Nell is excellent at tracking down records. She'll be able to help you. You don't have to flatter me, Alpha. I'll do my best to help you, Bunny. Most of the information we have about this operation is classified military intelligence with restricted access. 
Even Alpha and I can't get hold of it easily. However, I was able to identify the location of the operation zone. I've sent the coordinates to your receive. Again, this is classified military information, and it needs to stay that way. It has to remain confidential. mentioned the Colon Special Forces. Isn't that a secret spy unit? No wonder these records were classified. Hmm. I need to talk to someone who knew my parents. I don't think I'll get much out of Sharon or Freyna. Glay! Glay might know something. Hi, Bunny. Hmm, that's a serious look. What is it? Did you know that my parents were part of the Colon Special Forces? Hmm, yes. You finally found out, huh? I, I didn't know they were part of Colon, exactly, but I knew whatever operations they were doing, they weren't ordinary. You should know, Bunny. They joined the Colon Special Forces for you. When you were very young, I remember them saying, they wanted to create a world for you where you would have nothing to fear. I think that's why they joined. What do you mean? They became soldiers because they loved you so much. They wanted to protect you, the same as many people in Albion do now. It's ironic if you think about it. Okay, I, I can't think about that now. Do you know of any descendants who might know anything about the Colon Special Forces from around that time? Sharon. She was the only one who worked with your parents. Uh, Bunny, wait. Your parents were dealing with their own issues too, so... Yeah, I get it. I just need to know what it was exactly that they were dealing with.
Keep your questions brief. There you are, kid. Glay filled me in. I've been waiting for you. To be honest, I don't know much about your parents. Back then, I was just the youngest recruit, and they were pros. Don't be too disappointed, though. I do have a general idea of the operations that were carried out back then. There was an incident where a relic of the ancestors excavated by Albion was stolen by the Vulgus. Everyone in the Colon Special Forces was sent to retrieve it. I think your parents were part of that operation. I'll send you the coordinates of the operation zone where I believe they were most active. You should be able to find something there. Thanks. Good luck, kid. I didn't know that would be the last time I'd say that. It's a cruel twist of fate for your parents to die on your birthday, isn't it? They, they should have come back. Ugh. I should stop moping and start analyzing these records. Okay, the relic of the ancestors incorporated some kind of technology related to controlling RK abilities associated with electromagnetic forces. The creation of my suit must be proof that this technology was recovered, right? Anais was involved in that. I I'd better ask her about it. Now what do you want? Go on, I'm waiting. Welcome. You look like you need to ask me something. Are those operation records? I'd like to know about the operation that my parents were part of. What happened? What happened? Hmm. Sure, why not? I remember it very clearly. At the time, we had to find a way of recovering the relic of the ancestors. It was our top priority. Many people died during the operation. But these records you've brought are incomplete. We need to find a way to restore them so we can learn more of the specifics. If we retrieve some of the components from the battlefield where the operation was carried out, 
I might be able to restore the records. I need you to collect data chip fragments from the Agna Desert. I'll show you how to identify the ones you need.
If there's something you need, we have enough data. Oh, but there's an unexpected problem. The security measures that have been placed on the records are restricting my access. What a nuisance. I could use Albion's internal security tools, but that will mean the records will become publicly available. That means the circumstances around your parents' deaths will become public knowledge. I doubt that's what you want. Um, no. I don't want to publicize it to everyone in Albion. I understand. Well, there is another way. It's a little unorthodox. We can use the Volgus's security bypass tool. As it happens, there are some Order of Truth cultists who are after Albion's data. We can use that to work against them and help us.
If it's new research, unless ah, the records have been restored. Let's see. Seems that your parents were instrumental in recovering the relic of the ancestors. But the records don't specify the location from where their last transmission was sent. Hmm. That will make it difficult to trace. It won't be easy. But yes, I think there is a way. I've been working on a piece of technology that amplifies and traces specific communications frequencies. This is a good opportunity to test it. I've built a prototype. We may be able to use it to trace the coordinates of the last transmission. However, the device won't last long because it tends to overheat. I'll need to find a fix for that at some point. But we can test it with components from a Colossus. Specifically, I'll need some components with heat-resistant properties. Bring me a communications component from a pyromaniac.
Special human child. We can use this device to set up a trace and get the results we need. It shouldn't be long. Hmm. All right, we have the final coordinates. And it looks like my device is melted. I'll definitely have to make some improvements. That's not important right now. Where is the location? Come on! Impatient as ever, Bunny. I'm almost there. Hang on. Hmm. I... I know this place. The lab. The location was under our noses this whole time. The lab? Do you mean the Magister lab? It was abandoned when a proper research facility was built in Albion. It won't be easy to get there now with the Volgus in the way. I have a backup emergency device that can teleport you to the lab's entrance. I built it a long time ago, but this will be the first time it'll actually be used. If it's new research, I'm listening. Humanity is very weak. That's why humans need us so desperately. If there's something you need, you'll need to pay.
the trail ends. There must be clues around here. I need to find them. Fast! My mom becomes extremely painful around this time every year. Maybe it will hurt less once I do it. A 
if there's something you need. You I see. So that's what happened. Albion owes your parents a great debt. You can be proud of them. Your suit was created based on the data transmitted by your parents. It's like you're continuing their legacy. This is the final voice file. We reconstructed it based on the data we found. Would you like to hear it? The last voice file? Uh, okay, I'll listen. Good. After you've listened to it, go and see Sharon. She said she has something to tell you. Hang in there, Kaden. The data transmission should be done soon. Volgus will be here soon. Let's get ready. Kate, there's something I really need to tell you. Bunny has potential. It's extraordinary. Just before we left your tantrum, I could feel an electromagnetic force coming from her that made my hands tingle. And it seems to be connected to her emotions. I'm sure it's our Kate. Keep your questions brief. Welcome back, kid. I heard you've managed to clear some things up. That's good. Thank you, Sharon. I've been sorting through the belongings of the members of the Cologne Special Forces in Albion, whose deaths haven't been disclosed. Your parents' belongings are probably amongst them. If I find any, I'll send them to you. And make sure you thank everyone who's been looking out for you. Especially Glay. You can't act like a kid forever, you know? I know that! 
What sort of person do you think I am? Don't worry, I'm gonna do it right now. Hello, Bunny. Do you still feel conflicted about your parents? I'm not sure. I, I'm not sure, but I don't think so. Bunny, I... Honestly, I would sell my soul to the Volgus if it meant I could have my daughter back. The fact that you were fortunate enough to recover some of the records about your parents? Part of me envies you for that. I'm sure your parents felt the same way about you as I do about my daughter. Because parents are like that. I think I understand a little better now. I'm glad. And it's a little late. But happy birthday, Bunny. Thank you, Gley. I should report back to Alpha. There isn't much time. We have to hurry. Ah, Bunny, I've been expecting you. Thanks to you, we've been able to recover a good number of files and materials. And since we've been able to verify the records related to the operation that your parents were involved with, there will be special commendations for those who were killed in action. Yeah? Grandma would like that. And this is from Sharon. She said it seems to be something your parents left behind. A memento? There was something. Congratulations. Congrats, Bunny. <laughs> Happy birthday, Bunny. Congrats! <laughs> How did you know it was my birthday? We all knew. We were all just waiting to throw you a surprise party. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Congratulations, Bunny. <laughs> What the heck? This cake is soggy. <laughs> hey, it still tastes good. So what's the problem? <laughs> Dobby, what are you doing? Uh, I can't see. <laughs> hey, let me. Security. Don't imagine everybody's got 